Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. Happy Sunday, coming at you with 2021-22 Upper Deck SP Authentic Hockey. Four box, random team break number three. One spot gets you two teams and all card ship. The final four boxes of, the, uh, of this case is loaded up. That's the next break, break number four. <clears throat> Excuse me. Um, big thanks to Eric, Kurt, Kevin, and Steve for getting in on it. Let's double you up, like Sir Mix a lot. And all 32 teams are in. Let's roll it and randomize it. Five and a five. 10 times each. Two, five, six, seven, eight, and 10. And 10 times for the teams. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. We got the Coyotes down to the Blue Jackets. All right, Steve with the Arizona Coyotes, Eric with the Jets, Steve with the Bruins, Knights, and Red Wings, Kevin with the Ducks, Steve with the Flames, Panthers, Ottawa, Senators, Flyers, Blackhawks, Blues, Sabres, Canucks, and Islanders, Kurt with the Penguins, Steve Birch with the Wild, Capitals, and Lightning, Kevin with my Kings, Steve, Avs, and Preds, Kurt, Canadians, and Rangers, Steve, Maple Leafs, and Stars, Kurt with the Sharks, Eric with the Oilers, Steve with the Hurricanes, Eric with the New Jersey Devils and the Kraken, and Steve Birch with the Columbus Blue Jackets. All right, now let's alphabetize by team. And we're going to pause the video. When we come back, we're going to see if there's any trades. Then we'll have the break. Stick around. Be right back. All right, welcome back, everybody. No deals were done here in this four-box break. So the list right here remains the same here on Sunday the 23rd. Big thanks, everybody, for getting on the action. I am not, Eric. I am watching Oilers Kings. Kings were up early, 3 nothing, but Oilers have, uh, have scratched their way back to tie the game, and now it's the start of the third period. I think uh, Jason or whoever opened the first marked those with X's so we know they're from the same case. Eric's asking anyone who's watching the Nuggets game, why is A-Rod there? Um, yeah, he is the, I guess, co-owner of the Minnesota Timberwolves. Him and some big ownership group. But yeah, he owns the Timberwolves. I don't know when the sale is official. Maybe it's already official. But I don't know when it when it changes hands, but What are we looking for here? Collect at least one autograph future watch rookie per box. We're looking for hard signed limited auto material and upper the authentic cards for using premium game use material. Collect the immortal ink set featuring hard signed autos from the legends of the game. 
I've got a numbered card here, 54 out of 399 for the Ducks, Kevin with Anaheim. It's Troy Terry and Trevor Zegres. Who is the uh, who's the big rookie in this particular year? There's a uh, Sean Monahan, pageantry. There's an Austin Matthews die cut. And here's a future watch autograph, 33 out of 999, Alexander Holtz for the Devils. That's going to be for Eric Houston. I hope this he is a good one. <laughs> yes. Nice King's goal there. Andrew Vasilevsky, another die cut. And a Josh Bailey autograph. It says at least one autograph there. I guess there could be more. Islanders, that's going to be for Steve Birch. Nice. Good shot. Mike Tower, what's up? Oh, Quentin Byfield for the Kings. Cider for the Red Wings. Raymond for the Red Wings. And Cofield for the Canadiens. So, so those are some of the some of the players that I should be looking out for. You're not doing a case of it, are you? Nope. I wanted to see which case it is. Matt Roy with his first career postseason goal. All right. Did I pass up a Caps autograph? I don't think I did. Do you know who it, do you know who it was? This would have been the beginning right around here. No. Nope. I'd be surprised if there were three in a box. All right, box two. Mike Tower also saying Zegras for the Ducks, Swayman Bruins, Knight for the Panthers. Those are some other names uh, to look out for. Got a future watch, Alexander Holtz for New Jersey, 413 out of 900. It'll be for Eric.
Rex has trivia for us. Name the top four cities with the most sports championships in order. Probably Boston. Is first. And Los Angeles. Probably after that. And then New York. Here's a uh, Corel Vejmelka for the Coyotes, 376 out of 999. And there's David Pasternak Blue. That looks, I thought that might be numbered, but it's not. Just a different parallel. Because New York has like the Yankees and the Mets and the Islanders and the Rangers. Both of those pass tracks going to Steve Birch and the Bruins. And here's Dylan Cousins, sign of the times autograph for the Sabres. Buffalo! Steve Birch. And then Boston has the Bruins, the Celtics, the Patriots, the Red Sox. There, there's a lot of a lot of championship winning teams there. There's a Kaprizov. And the Dodgers have, and the LA has Dodgers, Lakers, Kings. Between them, they've there's a there's a decent number of titles there. I wonder if the I wonder if New York might be first. Is Teddy looking for Teddy? Are you looking for hockey? Yeah. Try that other room. New York, Boston, LA, and Chicago. That's the order. Yeah, it's gonna be like I think the Yankees have won 20 plus, 20 plus World Series on their own, so they're probably up there. So it's New York, then Boston, then LA, and then Chicago is the fourth. Do you have numbers for us, Rex? How many for each? Uh... Gotcha. New York has 65. Then Boston has 40. LA is 33 and Chicago 32. I remember from previous one that these are Spectrum FX tier ones. It's for the wild, Minnesota. That'll be for be for Steve Birch. Do most of these go? Yeah, all cards ship in this.
And a redemption. It's a SP Authentic Future Watch autograph. Mason McTavish. Old, old Mason McTavish, who is quite obviously a Swiss-born Canadian professional ice hockey center for the Anaheim Ducks, which I just recalled off the top of my head. That goes to Kevin and the Ducks. Not, on a, not off of a Wikipedia page. All right, there you go, Kevin. I don't know if he's good or not, but hopefully he is. For your sake. And we've got a uh, Maple Leafs autograph. That is Jack Campbell. The lettering's kind of weird there. 147 out of 299. Toronto, that's going to be Steve Birch. King still hanging on to that 4 3 lead. Over Connor McDavid and the Oilers. 10.32 left. Kings trying to take a 3-1 lead in this series, which would be awesome. All right. Final box. So New York has 65 titles amongst all their teams. The Yankees have 27 of them, which is about... And the, the Mets only have two. And what are the other half? I guess the Rangers have won some Stanley Cups. I feel like the Knicks really haven't won a lot of change unless back in the day. Where, what accounts for the other titles? Rangers and Islanders maybe? The hockey? You're saying there's 30, like 20 or 30 some odd titles in between in between the Islanders and the Rangers, and the Knicks and the Nets. Oh, are they counting Brooklyn Dodgers? Hmm. But that's only like two though. Most of the titles that the Dodgers have have been won in the LA years. We got Matthias Samuelson. And Mike Tower saying not bad for Mason McTavish this year. 80 games, 17 goals, 26 assists for a total of 43 points. Where are you getting this information from? We got, we got to fact check Rex. Steve with the uh, Bills. Uh, the Bills. The Sabres. Buffalo! We got an 890 out of 900. Uh... John Jason uh, Paterka? We'll go with that. Another one for Buffalo. Wikipedia. What do you so what what did you search on Wikipedia? Here's Jan Yenick for the Coyotes. 523 out of 999. Steve Birch with the Coyotes, last spot mojo. Lucas Raymond die cut. It looks like we got a patch auto coming up. And it's going to be limited auto material, Thomas Hurdle. 33 out of 50. That's a big, bold autograph from. A, Thomas.
That's going to be for San Jose. That will be for Kurt with the Sharks. Nice. Got Patrick Kane for the Blackhawks. All right, and that's that, ladies and gentlemen. That was SP Authentic Hockey. Appreciate everyone getting in. Another four boxes in the store, jazbeescasebreaks.com. I'm Joe. I'll see you next time for the next one. Go Kings, go.